India's indigenous Tejas Mach 2 fighter jet is set to revolutionize the IAF's quick reaction alert capabilities with its ability to carry eight beyond visual range air-to-air -air missiles simultaneously, surpassing all others in its class and potentially becoming a cornerstone of India's air defense strategy. Keshav Prasad director of India Supply Chain at Collins Aerospace, leads the company's ambitious plans to produce aerostructures, interiors, and avionics in India. With a $200 million investment, Collins aims to leverage India's skilled workforce and favorable business environment to streamline operations and enhance supply chain efficiency, fostering economic growth and technology transfer. After successful trials in Germany, an Indian Navy team heads to Spain to inspect the Navantia S-80 Plus submarine. This visit follows positive results from ThyssenKrupp Marine Systems U-212CD trials, ensuring a thorough evaluation of contenders for Project 75I. The upcoming field evaluation trials will inform the Navy's decision on selecting the submarine that aligns with its operational requirements. The development of the indigenous LCA Tejas Mach 2 progresses with the introduction of an Iron Bird facility. This hardware in-loop testing environment evaluates the Integrated Flight Control System IFCS, before flight testing. The facility replicates flight scenarios, enabling engineers to assess IFCS performance under various conditions and identify potential issues for rectification. Abu Dhabi-based Edge Group aims to strengthen its presence in India's defense sector, after offering the al Tariq smart weapon for the LCA Tejas Mach 1A program. Edge now focuses on fulfilling India's aerial weapon requirements with the Desert Sting 25 guided glide weapon. Tailored for UAV integration, the Desert Sting 25 boasts precision, range, and payload capacity, offering a formidable solution for India's defense needs. DRDO to carry out the reliability and safety analysis of Astra Mach 1 integration on LCA, Astra Missile in Flight Risk Assessment Analysis is planned for four different scenarios. The study will assess the effects of Astra on flight safety during different malfunction scenarios. The Indian Army's Major General VK Sharma announces plans to halt ammunition imports in the next financial year, 2025-26, barring exceptional cases. This marks a significant milestone in India's defense indigenization efforts, with indigenous suppliers now covering 150 out of 175 ammunition types. Notably, private manufacturers like Adani and Tata are contributing to this shift. The Russian Foreign Ministry refutes U.S. claims of Indian involvement in a foiled assassination plot against pro-Khalistan radical Gurpatwant Singh Panu. Spokesperson Maria Zaharova criticizes Washington for lacking evidence and disrespecting India's national context, suggesting the allegations are part of interference in India's internal affairs. India's External Affairs Ministry rejects similar claims, calling them speculative and unwarranted.